of the city. This is so crazy. You have to buy this. Something like this. Which one? This. This is? No. Hello. Hello. What is the price of the pizza? Um, the tuna and the salami is yes. 10 euros. The battery is 8 and a half. The nice to see you, brother. Good to see you. See you on the dance floor. Bye. This is Kyortus, this is what you mean, the Kyortus, yeah, the this long is what one. I mean, this is the Hungarian, yeah, 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 the Hungarian. Okay. Good morning, guys. Just wake up. First day of the Ozora festival. We just arrived here yesterday night. And basically, this was already built but we built this tent that is huge with a lot of things inside and uh, let's go out uh, so this is basically where we are located and if you knew this if you know this place this is a tobacco shop over there and we are just behind it i will show you this tent also that you can see so we have a generator here we have a lot of food here and basically this food and everything is for hosting people from the festival that will come here this food is gonna be given to them free with no charge everyone can come and join the festival that we doing here basically most people that come here are Israelis but everybody is welcome here okay so this is the people that in charge of this amazing hospitality that's going to be here who guys I'm so excited you know first day of the festival just wake up went to sleep last night very very late four and a half we just came here at one o'clock at night and start build everything from scratch except like I told you this shady um, uh, this shady oh it start raining this is this is nice it's very very light rain but and with a lot of sun so must be a rainbow I believe so I want to tell you that today the Ozora begins after the boom and this ground much more comfortable than the one that in the boom because you can actually walk on it and it's without any spikes so you walk very very easily and you feel very very comfortable and wow we are actually here and it's been a while since 2019 I haven't been here I missed this place so right now I'm going to start my day my morning I have a mission I need to find a locker for the bag that I have inside the tent not this one this is my luggage I think this will be here I have to build another shady place here like above these tents and basically start exploring the place and show you guys how the Azora looks from the inside if you are here you will be happy to see that and if you haven't been here you also will be happy to see that and see how the place looks from the inside and my experience so let's begin let's start the morning so guys, last glimpse before I leave and show you the festival. Look at this place that we built here. Okay, this is we added after after we put the tents this morning. This shade and look at this place. I'll show you another time inside that you're gonna see here we have a lot of potatoes, onions, garlic. We have lentils here, we have tomatoes in canes. 
we have pasta look how much pasta how much pasta so much you have frigidaire by the way guys you have frigidaire that is working and active and this is my berries from the morning and my oat milk as you can see and some beers also because you know we are in a festivals and we have to have a beers and some mattresses the people are gonna sleep here as you can see this mattress this mattress the suitcases we have gas balloons for cooking we have some fuel for the generator that is located for not disturbing us pretty far away where you see the red the red uh, box this is the generator over there so it's pretty far we cannot hear it and this is basically it we have also water for cleaning the dishes and looks perfect so what we are going to do right now i'm gonna go and give you a do a tour inside the festival let's go guys okay guys so, so guys basically we are at the ozora trying to uh, starting to go here start to explore a little bit see the places that they have here what they did in uh, when I compare it to 2019 actually from what I saw the main stage didn't change a lot it stays pretty pretty much the same but I also miss the bridge here I don't know to those of you who've been here before there is a very very nice uh, bridge that is decorated with a uh, hand and nails this is by the way guys the place that you can chill after you know, like a long day in the dance floor you can come here like lay down nice vibes over there you get to rest a little bit from what i remember last time also had some uh, some magnesium uh, drink so you can recover and this is the bridge that i was talking about actually look at that people actually built also tents over here this is a very nice place also this is uh the tea tea place usually we sit here chill by uh, they, they give you like the tea for free and from what i remember from what i know the tea is from herbs from the ozora territory so it's very very nice so guys look at that bridge the bridge the bridge is like this is like a hand and it goes over there and this is like the nails that i was talking about so look how they shape the tree look at the nail look at that how it looks like it's very psychedelic very very psychedelic look at that it's part of the bridge later on i will go to explore and go through the bridge also and let's go inside where is the music the only stage that is working right now is the Pumpui stage and the Pumpui uh, crew this is who is playing right now so the main stage should start today at 8 I think this is the opening ceremony like where everybody is going to be and this is a very traditional ceremony that all the people most people come here and uh, celebrate it very very special one like I think a lot of the Hungarian culture are involved in this ceremony so it's very very beautiful I hope this music won't make me a big trouble with the video with the monetization but look at that place all the people are dancing here having fun and let's go all right let's go what i need to do basically right now guys is take this bag that i have my equipment inside my gear inside my filming gear and put it inside 
this uh, place uh, that is located over there and basically they have uh, lockers for the uh, gear before I came here like two hours ago and I uh, asked them for lockers so they told me they have also small lockers and also big lockers so the small lockers it's mostly for money and very very small things like purse and cameras and the big one it's for pack backpacks like this maybe you can see my backpack yes yes the locker is over over here located over there yes and they basically charge you for one euro a day and guys i can tell you that i just came from the boom it's much cheaper than the boom festival the boom festival charge you for 30 euros for the locker uh, from the beginning of the festival till the end of the festival but the main difference is that every time you took out you take out your your bag you know for taking some stuff out for example a camera that you want to take and they charge you for extra five euros here you can take it out as much as you want and you won't get charged so it's much more let's say profit like let's say it's much less expensive and much more comfortable in terms of taking your stuff out and not charged by the festival so let's go and we are entering basically this is the where people sit eat and charge their phones and this is like two main roads over here and over here and here like most of the jewelries of the festival here are also a lot of food places you can buy food and i believe that we're gonna explore the food also and this is the dome the dome uh, dance floor okay so this is where we need to go I hope this is not the line for the lockers and uh, but if it is the line we will wait until we get service it opened in two o'clock p.m. so I think no this is not the line basically we don't have a line this is the line for the food so we don't have any line okay Hello, this is the queue guys, yeah. this is the queue, you're waiting for a service, yes. okay, for lockers or something like that, or no, no, for uh, buy t-shirts, ah, you buy t-shirts from ah, here, okay, you can also buy t-shirts, nice, okay, um, so okay, I didn't know they sell t-shirts, for how much, five euros, yeah. okay, nice, okay, okay, let's see the t-shirts, Okay, so they actually sell here Ozora t-shirts, I didn't know that. Okay, and people are really into buy them and they look actually very nice printing on them. So let's see, maybe I can get service. Yeah. yeah, the locker is here. Ah, this is the locker. Yes, this is the locker. But they bring shirts. Why? Yeah, they also they also sell shirts here, and okay. they also uh, they also sell t-shirts. So okay. they also sell t-shirts and also uh, have lockers. So okay. it's both services in this uh, counter. Guys, now we are on the line. Hello, I'm filming it for YouTube. It's okay, Mira. Yeah. Okay, amazing. So Mira, basically, what I want is to put my backpack in a locker. Okay. Okay. This is yours. Okay. So I think the end of the festival. Yes, but I can pay in advance. Back. So no, no, no. You have to come back every day. Okay, and pay the one euro. Yes. Okay. So one, what, what is the time that I need to come Doesn't here and matter. pay? Just Doesn't matter. Back. Okay, no problem. So every day one euro, right? Yes. And please, could you write your name here and here? sign here and here okay why by the way it's two of them uh, yes or? please ah no i just asking why it's like 64 and 64 i just not just one just asking like why because, two because uh, i we have one and you we have one 
Sorry, we have. You have one and I have one. No, just this. Yes, but like this and. This ah, is ah like okay, 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 okay. Now nah, this is like a copy for you. Yes, okay, okay, yes, okay. Yes. I understand you. Okay, so I sign here yes. and, and put here. my. And put your name here and here. Okay, my full name. Yes, please. Okay. Also, I have a bag for you. This. Okay. Uh, this is for you. You have to get another bag because it won't fit in one. The two bags. Yeah, she will uh, can uh, yeah. take another separate. Yeah, yes. Of Just a moment. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. So now I give you one euro for today, yes. and tomorrow I come yes, and bring yes. you some more one euro. Yes. Ah, like every day one euro. Yes, yes. Every day you need to come and bring one euro. Okay. So this is for today. Okay, this is the one euro. This is for you. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. I will put. Hold it for me a little bit. For yeah, a second. of course. Okay. safe guys because this is I need to come with it every day pay my one euro and basically uh, this is how they will recognize yeah. me and my bag so yeah I put it in my wallet in the safest okay. place I can so this is mine okay so mission one accomplished so guys look at these people making all these stunts with these uh, ropes and balls connected to them I think maybe there will be some fire fire exhibitions at night so it will be very nice you know to film it also and also to watch it at night and in this festival usually you have very very talented people doing these uh, things so it can be very very nice to watch so I think we are about to end the road of the festival and arrive to the main stage or we have a little bit more over there you know to arrive to and this is like the food and also clothes and all kind of things you have here on the side of the road and i i actually i can tell you that i don't feel like there is a lot a lot of people although it's already the first day maybe some more people need to arrive today and it will be full but right now I don't see a lot of people there is some nice waste bags over here very very nice and very nice pizza from what I see yes come to see this is so crazy you have to buy this which one this this is? No, wow. this is not my kind of style. No, this is amazing. Yes, you think so? Yeah. Very psychedelic, look, definitely. Look what she did. Look. Ah, this is how she was. This is a, yes, very nice. Very psychedelic. Hello, Hello. how are you? Hi. Fine. Wow. Look at that. I'm great. Okay. Not my type of uh, clothing. Actually, I'm pretty hungry, but I want to explore before I buy some food. What is going on here? Because this is my first time in the food uh, area. So let's see the pizzas. Look amazing. Hello, hello. What is the price of the pizza? Um, the tuna and the salami is yes. ten euros. The veggie is eight and a half. The Ten euros, seven. eight and a half. Yeah. And seven. 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 Okay. Okay. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Bye bye. Okay. So pretty much the same like the Boom Festival. You have here a cafe, from what I see, and maybe some uh, some food also. It looks like Indian food. 
Yes, like samosa. You want some salad? You remember the place with the vegetarian food, with the veggie food that yeah. we ate last time yeah, when yeah, we were here that, in 2019? Yeah, I remember. It was very, very good also, yeah. right? This is a very small salad. This is vegan salad, I yes. Think. yes, it's a vegan. It's a vegan, yeah. Not veggie, but vegan, yes. Because it vegan. was with cheese, yes. Yeah, yeah. There is a lot of waste bags here. Maybe you will find something for you? No. Oh. No, no, no. It's too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need something more professional. High, high quality, yeah. Yes, more professional Where is one. Little? little is in front of you. Yeah. yeah, so you can see here, guys, a lot of. A lot of, uh, like things for the main stage you know like nice hats with these crazy scuba scubas scubas I don't know if I'm saying it correctly but I think it's scubas nice hat nice nice shop so a lot of uh, a lot of uh, vans here you know Yeah. Nice to see you, brother. Good to see you. See you on the desk floor. Bye. So a lot of vans here, and this is actually a subscriber of ours in our Instagram channel, and he actually recognized us and just approached us and told us that we talked with him in the past. So it was very nice to see him. And also very nice, also all the time it's very nice to meet your subscribers, your followers. Very exciting, you know, to see that people actually recognizes you. Recognize you. So, we are in a nice junction here and we have a right and left. So, it just reminds me a lot of the place actually like 2019 when I was here it's very very nice to be back the Elzora festival and see all the happy people all the peace and love and light that you have in those festivals so this is a very nice place where you can buy some sweets corazons and coffee and cakes cupcakes look at that look at that chocolate cupcakes corazon chocolate cakes very, very nice stuff if you have like a sugar addiction like mine so after I eat my meal I like to grab some something sweet so let's go and this is Kyortus, this is what you mean the Kyortus, yeah, the long one. I mean, this is the Hungarian, yeah, 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 the Hungarian uh, yeah. dessert. Yeah. Yes, so this is a traditional Hungarian dessert, Kyortus. Those of you who know this, okay. Okay. Salad. No, it doesn't look that good. Okay. <laughs> I believe that a lot of the things that and all the atmosphere are going to change when when the music going to start. So right now, main stage and most stages are not, except the Pumpui, are not working. So most people are usually here in this area. And I think it will be also less people here while the music will start. So definitely I could see it in the Boom Festival, at the Boom Festival when the music started, it changed everything. So I believe that it will be here the same. Of course, I can remember it, but very, very slightly from 2019. This is the best water I, I like tasted it's very very good the Hungarian water by the way compared to the water in Portugal that are disaster I mean they are full of chlorine and here they are very very pure water let's have some 
Okay. Wow, so fresh. So cold. And tastes so good. Wow. Best water in the world. Definitely. That was very, very good. So, I think this is like the end of the road of the of the uh, of the food section, and like it continues a little bit more. And this is where all the magic happens, you know. From what I see, they didn't change the um, the stage shady, the stage shade from 2019. It's still the same. I believe that it's connected to the reason that they didn't have any festival from 2019 because of the pandemic and these kind of places that are so big so huge i think that you know it needs a lot of money to just keep it alive keep it going you know just to keep the you know the grass uh, cut all the time and everything keep working that when they have the possibility to make the festival everything will be ready so this is why i think they saved a little bit of money and didn't change like they do every year because usually every year they make a new uh decorating new decorating decoration to the to the stage this year they didn't so this is the last food kiosk and what are they selling here oh it's look like fries and what they're selling here fries so ah, okay okay thank you very much chambert nuggets chambert i don't know camembert 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 nuggets, chicken nuggets, breaded meat, mushroom bites, cauliflower bites. Okay. Looks actually sounds delicious. But I'm not for this kind of fried, deep fried things right now. And they have also the place of the Ozora Festival where they sell their own food. This is the restaurants of the Ozora Festival. This is people are coming, private people and can make their own food and of course they pay rent to the festival so in the middle over there there will be fire today and I'm pretty excited for the opening ceremony I have to tell you guys and look how vast and big all this place and of course the sounds here is superb is amazing so guys, I think for right now, for the first chapter, I think I'm gonna end this video right here. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And of course, remember to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos. And I'll see you of course on the next video. So bye bye, ciao for now.